In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to use inline positioning in Elementor. As you can see here, I'm already in the page editor where I've already added a template. Here you can edit the page as per your requirement. But if you need help editing the page with Elementor, we have a video where you can learn that as well. I'll link it in the description below, or you can also click on the eye icon on the top right corner of your screen to view the video. Now, on scrolling a little to this page, you can see a section here with various elements in it. I want these two buttons to be in a line. To do so, you need to first go to the button settings using the pen icon like this. Click on the Advanced tab, and here under the Width heading, set it as Inline. Similarly, move to the second button settings, and again under the Advanced tab, select Inline Width. You can see the buttons have been positioned in line. This is how easy it is. On scrolling a little more, you can see the text has been positioned in line here. You can even adjust the vertical alignment of the text. To do so, simply go to the settings of the text whose alignment you want to adjust, and under the Advanced tab, you can see Vertical Alignment Settings. Simply set the alignment from here as per your requirement. And you can repeat the process with the other two as well. And this is how easy it is to use inline positioning in Elementor. And that's it for today's video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button. If you're new to our channel, hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our future videos. Thanks for watching. We'll see you at the next one.